to modify this uh, C car for lithium ion batteries. What you need is the car itself, of course, a lithium ion battery. I'll go into the details later. Battery holder with wires and, of course, a screwdriver. You get a solder, a male, female header, a jumper cable to the battery holder. And the whole stuff goes together like this. First of all, you have to remove the original rechargeable battery, which in my case was totally flat and wouldn't hold charge. I got this on a Christmas party for the kids, but it was no fun to play with for them. So it rested for a while in the basement and we had to get it to life again. It's a nickel metal hydrate battery pack, 600 milliamp hours and it's got 3.6 volts nominally at least. The female sockets of the cable go into the uh, battery connector of the car. The battery by the way is a 14500 lithium-ion battery uh, which is the same size as an AA battery that's why the battery holder fits so neatly and it's got 3.7 volts which is just insignificantly higher than the original. I got this uh, rechargeable battery from my little flashlight. I don't quite trust the, the ratings on it, but well, it does the job. Put it all in the battery compartment and when I got this in I can close the lid. Uh, you might want to go for slightly shorter wires uh, to make less of a mess in there. Bolt down the battery compartment lid. And here we go. Yep, it's got power and... Okay, looks good. Now let's go outside and see if the kids have fun with it. Yeah, it's much better than before. Uh, it actually started stuttering uh, when it went round the corner because uh, the steering is motor driven and that Ow. wouldn't work. 